In our latest videos, we talked about food, diet, and drinks that can improve your immune system and overall health. In today's topic, we'll give you the benefits and side effects of an amino acid supplement that boosts the well-known antioxidant glutathione. Stay tuned to Natural Education, and if you haven't watched our latest stories, we'll leave the links to the videos in the description below. Let's jump right into it. N-acetylcysteine commonly known as NAC, is an antioxidant that comes from the amino acid L-cysteine. Cysteine is a non-essential amino acid used for making collagen and protein. It is also responsible for other metabolic functions. NAC can support your body's lack of cysteine, and you can extremely benefit from an adequate intake of NAC supplements. NAC is found in protein-rich foods such as chicken, beef, eggs, yogurt, and legumes. The daily recommended amount for NAC is 600 to 1,800 milligrams, and it may increase depending on your body's needs and conditions. NAC is an approved drug by the US Food and Drug Administration, but experts advise that prescription products that contain NAC must be given by a healthcare provider to ensure your safety. Recent news has put this product under the spotlight, and NAC is now a red-hot topic thanks to recent regulatory actions taken by the US FDA. It appears that NAC cannot be lawfully marketed in a dietary supplement since the ingredient was first approved as a drug in 1963. Despite this breaking news, NAC has tons of benefits, but in this video, we'll only discuss four of its popular uses. Do you have other health topics in mind? Leave us your suggestion in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and ring the notification bell so you won't miss any videos that we upload every week. Let's dive into some of the benefits of NAC supplements. Number one, regulated glutathione and glutamate levels. You may often associate glutathione with anti-aging and whitening products. It is because glutathione is the most important antioxidant in your body. NAC primarily replenishes glutathione and its bonds with other amino acids like glutamine and glycine. Glutathione is responsible for neutralizing free radicals that cause cellular damage, reduces damage to body tissues, and is important in improving immune health. Experts also believe that this antioxidant can contribute to a longer life because of its anti-aging functions. As NAC boosts glutathione to prevent oxidative damage to your brain cells, it eventually regulates glutamate levels and promotes brain health. Glutamate is a brain neurotransmitter that plays a huge role in learning, behavior, and memory. Some psychiatric conditions that NAC helps to mitigate are Alzheimer's and Parkinson's disease. The neurotransmitter dopamine is particularly affected by Parkinson's disease as it deteriorates the cells that produce dopamine. NAC supplements can reduce symptoms of the disease and can improve dopamine function as well. Number two, prevent kidney and liver damage. NAC is commonly used in emergency rooms to treat victims of paracetamol and acetaminophen overdose. Acetaminophen is a drug that is used to cure fever and to relieve chronic pain. And NAC is given to patients of a drug overdose because it can prevent further damage to your liver and kidneys. NAC also detoxifies the liver and kidneys by preventing dangerous effects of environmental factors, such as exposure to heavy metals that may affect these organs in the long run. Number three, relieved symptoms of lung illness. NAC not only replenishes glutathione levels in your liver, but also boosts this antioxidant in your lungs. This explains why NAC supplements are being used to improve the symptoms of chronic obstructive pulmonary disease. According to Healthline, NAC reduces inflammation in your bronchial tubes and lung tissues. Long-term oxidative damage and inflammation of the lung tissue causes airways to constrict, and it leads to shortness of breath and coughing. According to one study, COPD symptoms and lung function may significantly improve if you take 600 milligrams of NAC twice a day. NAC also works well for people with chronic bronchitis, which is a lung condition that occurs when the mucous membranes in your lungs become inflamed, swell, and shut off the airways to your lungs. Other respiratory conditions that NAC can improve are asthma, pulmonary and cystic fibrosis, and nasal and sinus congestions. NAC reduces symptoms like coughing, wheezing, and respiratory attacks by boosting glutathione levels and decreasing the mucus in the bronchial tubes. Thus, NAC breaks up the mucus and decreases the inflammation in the lungs because of its antioxidant capacity. Number four, improve symptoms of psychiatric disorders. It was mentioned 
that adequate glutamate levels help treat Alzheimer's and Parkinson's disease. However, too much of it can also cause damage to the brain. It is hypothesized that depleted glutathione but excessive glutamate levels may contribute to psychiatric conditions like bipolar disorder, schizophrenia, and obsessive compulsive disorder. NAC helps improve symptoms of depression and bipolar disorder and allows the patient to act and function normally. Researchers also found that NAC may help treating mild to severe OCD. According to Goodson, NAC supplements also reduce symptoms of schizophrenia, such as apathy, social withdrawal, and reduced attention spans. Despite the promising benefits of NAC to certain diseases, this semi-essential amino acid still has to undergo further research to be fully effective. Some other benefits still lack legitimate research. Have you tried taking NAC supplements before? Let us know about your experiences in the comment section below. Alongside great benefits, there are some quite awful side effects of NAC supplements. Number one, nausea and vomiting. Too many NAC supplements may also cause adverse effects on your body. Nausea and vomiting most likely happen due to the unpleasant smell of the drug, which makes it hard for someone to swallow or consume. Excessive intake of NAC may also cause other gastrointestinal disturbances. Number two, hypersensitivity. According to drugs.com, some of the so-called anaphylactoid symptoms of NAC are bronchiospasm or airway obstruction, hypotension, shock injection site reaction, or visible rashes. These symptoms often occur during or after intravenous infusion. Hypersensitivity symptoms may vary on NAC dosage, and careful monitoring by healthcare providers is recommended. Number three, mild side effects. Respiratory side effects may also appear and can include any of the following, cough, wheezing, stridor, tightness of chest, shortness of breath, and respiratory distress. Other rare side effects may include fever, chest pain, and raised temperature. Oral NAC supplements normally come in capsules, soft gels, and tablets. Due to its accessibility, excessive NAC intake may happen and can cause mild side effects such as diarrhea, constipation, fatigue, eye irritation, and skin rashes. Experts believe that taking NAC supplements frequently is not recommended because most of its benefits still require a lot of research to be proven effective. Most NAC supplementation research is done on small scale, and that's why a patient needs to consult a healthcare provider first before taking NAC supplements. Natural Education advocates a well-informed and healthy community. We hope that you learn what might be benefits, but also consequences of using NAC supplements. If you find this video helpful, give us a thumbs up and share it with your family and friends as well.